to Minecraft Dad again with me, Paul McJay. So today we are going to be doing cameras. And look, I got a nice TV camera and a also a security camera. So this is a TV camera, looking a bit freaky. And there's the security camera. Looks like the eye of Sauron sort of following you around. It was a bit freaky. So, this is how it works. Ooh, very freaky. Right, so I've already saved this uh, to, a uh, to a structure block. Essentially, I can't be asked to use clone command, so I've just done that. If you want to know how to use structure blocks, see uh, one of my earlier videos. Right. I just need to know how many blocks this is down. I don't want to be messing around with heights and things at a later point. You'll see what I mean. So let's go down two blocks. Stick that in. Right, so what's the name of it? So we'll just go into there, into load, and it's camera. I've already seen it as camera, so we'll type in camera, down to load, and that should load my camera into position so I don't have to build it again. Oh, see that's weird glitching? It's because, you'll see what I mean, there's an entity with the same name. You'll see what I mean in a moment. Let's go into there. So we just need to turn those, com those command block states to, uh, from always active to these redstone so they're not always on. Just do that for all four blocks. Now, if you notice, those blocks are purple because they're set to repeat. All right, here we go. So, what we're going to do now is show you how this thing works. First of all, basically just to note how to build the camera, basically, if you want to do that. Just stick it down just to show you. So there's a redstone block with a piston, a sticky piston. And there's two observer blocks on top, facing each direction, so there's it creates that little blinking effect, which is quite cool because it looks like a, a working camera. Um, a bit of stained glass on the side, a comparator at top, item frame with a piece of uh, glass there. So it looks like a viewfinder and a button on the side. Now, this is how we're going to make the effect. So we need an armor stand, two armor stands, in fact. Right, one, two. So. One is going to be called body and one is going to be called lens. So we'll do the lens first. Stick and I have end door on that hand. And we just need a wither block now to stick on the outside. So we're just going to stick a So we're just going to stick a wither skeleton skull on top of the head there. Okay, so we need them at a certain angle. So we need we're gonna need a first of all we'll just label them. So we'll label this one lens three. Now I'll show you how to change the label names in the with the and a little point, but I've already pre-named these. So we're just gonna put the body three label on the one with the wither skull. It's just so it doesn't cause any weird glitches in the game I'll show you in the next part so we're just going to move these body shapes to that position so they're facing at a certain angle there we go. and that one's that perfect now let's go and add these to the camera so it's going to do the Oh. Yeah, just body three, remember, and lens three. So these are command blocks that have already been copied from the previous the previous build over there. So let's go into the command. So it's forward slash at TP teleport at entity. That's the armor stand. In those brackets there, the body. So that was the previous command. So we're going to change that to body three. And those are the, the heights of where that's going to be facing. And then facing at player. So basically that command will make it follow you around. 
So we change that to body three. And we need to change that now to always active. There we go. And if you know what's there, that armor stand named body three with the wither head skull is now positioned at that angle at the front of that observer block. See, now we need to put the eye of endor on the lens armor stand there. Uh, was positioned in front of that wither skull. So yeah, it's still. So yeah, that's nice and that's turning quite nicely now. So let's get the other bit done. So we just need to change that to lens three. Now those tilders and positions they may change obviously depending on the way you've built it, but that's for this build that's the other numbers. There we are, look there's those two armor stands together there now obviously we don't want those armor stands there so we need to add a second set of command blocks with an invisibility effect so that's the command so forward slash effect add entity and we are so we want to change that to body three and then invisibility one space one true Okay, I'll just change them first and then we'll switch them to always. Uh, always need red, um, always need red stop. Right, so let's change that one for the lens as well. Lens three. Always active. Uh, that's disappeared. Uh, let's do the other one. Always active. Right. And we are, and look. And we are, that's positioned perfectly, and now it follows you around. Still freaks me out. So now we're going to do uh, the security camera. Now, yeah, again, I, I've, so, I've saved it to a, a structure block, and I can't be bothered to build it. But I'm going to change it slightly because I don't think that looks quite right for a security camera. Right, okay, so that's saved a security camera. So I'll just go find a place, stick that now. Oh, yeah, better see what is how many blocks is it down? Yeah, two blocks down. So I'll stick that down, two blocks. No, what are we doing? Right in there. Load. Load. Security camera. Right, let's just load that now. There right, we are, pop that up. Now, if you know some weird glitches going on, it's because that saved, obviously, from an earlier build. That's just got body in it, so it's confusing that one previous uh, section over there so let's just change let's just switch all these off to these redstone quickly so that way a glitching goes away for all four blocks perfect okay and while we're here we'll also change these now if you notice on this one lens at the bottom and bodies at the top. It's, it's different for this way. Um, so we're just going to change that. So the next one we're going to change out the lens four because we've already got a lens three. So we've already confusing it on this on this bit as well. And if you notice, the uh, the heights are different, obviously because it's a different size build. You may have to play around with them slightly, obviously, to get them positioned perfectly. Four. Four. Okay, so I'm just going to change this up now. I'm going to move it a block backwards. Right, let's get a quartz block. Yeah, 
quartz. Quartz. Let's build that up. Oh no, that's the wrong one. Shit. Right, and we need a block of quartz. There we are. That we go. And we're just gonna need a lever to create that sort of uh, security camera effect. So I'll stick that there. Oh, is that too far in? I don't know. Hmm. No. Oh. Get rid of you a minute. Oh, I don't know, mate. Yeah, I'll have to do. Stick it back. Yeah, it's gonna have to do right this. So let's build our body and lens armor stands. One, two. So let's take our wither head on this one. Let's get our eye of endo back. Stick that there. Do 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 in that hand. There we go. Right, just get the positions right. Now, as you, we have to obviously squat down, I'll see we don't do to get the positions right. There we go. So we just need to change our name tags here to body four. So we'll just show you that. So stick that in there. And let's just change that to four. There we go. And let's build that. All right, stick that there. Let's label that now. Body four, perfect. And just do the same again for the lens. Why you Sauron? <laughs> right, so go. Lens four. Now let's switch all these block states back to all, always active. Why am I putting that there? Stop it. Right, go. Always active. Now it's there. Yes, it's there. Follow me round. It is. Right. Always active. Right, now let's switch the block states for the invisibility effect so they disappear. Perfect. And let's take that one back on. There we go. Now well, that's a lot better than the other one, especially from that distance. Yeah, it's following me around basically. Perfect. So that's it guys, I'll see you again on the next video, ciao for now.